Hi, Mom. Hi, Woods. Here's Led Zepp's announcement. Let's see if he comments. <laughs> All right, quiet on the Sid. Quiet on the set. You're listening to WRFB Radio Free Britannia. In no other freaking better place in the world than Deltona, Florida. Here you are. Lunch with no other than the dynamic duo themselves, Laz and Jack. Greetings, everybody. This is Laz. And that's Jack playing with himself. Hello, Jack. I don't know. Is Jack alive? Did we lose Jack? I'm sorry. Jack's not here because he's too busy staring at his crotch. Uh, let's see if he's actually moving. Yeah, he's moving. Uh, Jack? Hello? He's really preoccupied with whatever he's doing. Waiting on What's you. Up, Les? I can't hear you. What do you mean you can't hear me? Can you hear me? We can hear you. Mom can hear me. I didn't change my audio settings. Well, since did you mute yourself? No, I'm coming through. I didn't through. hear the intro play either. Intro came through. You. Wait, it's hold all on. you. I'm not seeing anything light up in Discord either. What the fuck? Hey, lighting up over here. We hear you. <laughs> yeah, you you hold you're on. sitting there dinking with whatever it is in your lap there. Econdis, what's up, buddy? Hello, Jack. Yes, I can hear you now. Okay. Uh, that, that, I click go live and Discord audio dropped. Yeah. Well, maybe you what should. Is that shit? Maybe you should hard set your audio instead of using default because default uh, sucks. No, no, I keep, no, I keep no, 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 no. <laughs> it is. It is hard set in Discord. 
Hard set I told it in you that before the show. Hard set it in Streamlabs. Hard set it in Windows. Be done hey, with man. it. And it, it, it <laughs> that, that shit was all working everywhere else. Uh -huh. The problem is the Bluetooth headphones get charged occasionally and that disconnects them. Ah, okay. So, yeah, so you can't exactly hard set something that is going to be disconnected all the time. Hitting us up with the sub 32 months. Oh. And, and Econdis is a big project at work with meeting every day during lunch. Yeah. And Bridge Stroll says that he wants the House of Pain. The House of Pain. <clears throat> and you know who doesn't have marbles loaded? You. Wow. Yeah, Econdis, uh, people were worried about you. They hadn't seen you in a while. And I realized this is, well, shit, I hadn't seen him in a while either. Is, uh, I better ping him and make sure everything's okay. But uh, there he is. They're using Microsoft Teams. Well, at least it's better than Twitter's uses of, of uh, uh, Slack. <laughs> you, you mean Twitter is no, no longer use of Slack since they cut the license? Yeah. Uh, and, and, and Elon barely might be saving himself $100 million. But I have, ooh, prefer Zoom. Uh, yeah. I, I Noob don't like Sky Blabber with the sub for 39 months. Thank you, Noob. Uh, but you, you know, it's uh, time to do exclamation mark play, exclamation mark, I love free shit, exclamation mark, bundle me to get in on all those giveaways because Laz and I are clicking start in Dry Zwei Eins Go. How do you say go in German? Good question. I don't. I don't know. I, I just uh, learned the uh, three three most commonly needed words in German, beer? which will get which will get you anywhere. Beer, beer, toilet, and taxi. All which, which are pronounced the same. beer, toilet, and taxi. Toilet and taxi. Yeah. <laughs> You can get anywhere, you can get yourself a drink, and you can go to the restroom. The three most important words to know in German. That's right. Yes. Absolutely. All right. 25 seconds left. Hype train is close. Um, two minutes, 20 seconds to trigger the hype train working up there. Noob Sky Blabber, you want to give us a track number or you want us to go to news? Bridge Troll with 300 bits. That's going to okay. get him a mystery game key. As we head on down through the House of Pain. Okay, House of Pain coming down and things are going weirdly. Oh, uh, yeah. 300 bits Steam key for Bridge Troll. 300 bits Steam 300 key. 300 bits from Tina. Tina. And that kicks off the hype train. Laz currently in the lead on my side. Mom's That'll currently give in second. Tina a choice of a track also. Yes. Mom is about to pass up Laz if she can figure out how to get through this thing. Nope. As we are rimming the hole. She, she's got the exact same problem as Laz. You can't figure out how to get down to the little little brown hole. Now it's time for both of them to start rimming the little brown hole. Who's going to be first to plunge into the little brown hole? Noob it Sky Blabber. Laz. Blasting through everybody into the triple threat mixers. Oh, Mom now in the lead. Mom, the first one into the double mixing. Mom threw first one into the second one. Laz now in caught up with her, but Laz delayed by the second mixing bowl. Mom threw the third. Yeah, same here. Mom made it through the third one in front of everybody mm -hmm. else. Now the feeling final set everybody's of dreams. And mom getting some scrolls. Times two. Yes. Congratulations, Mom. 
And then Wee, more mind hopping. Yes. As soon as I send you scrolls. Oh, come on. Continue. Then then drag and drop. Tina wants the labs with the bubbler stuff, and Noob Skyblabber wants a random. Okay. The lab with the bubbler stuff. That'll be the last one. Yeah, well, we got to find... Uh, uh, is that Mavs? That's the new, the, the new one, yeah. Yeah, got to wait for Tina to try to get finish this map. Oh... But meanwhile, yeah, let's get some wall. game keys out here. We're going to get a copy of A Little Golf Journey going oh. out to Bridge Troll. And Arcade Paradise, Arcade Paradise EP going out to Tina. Um. And then we're going to do a giveaway here, which I got to do in just a moment once I get these two keys out. But let's go ahead and uh, get the random track working. Oh, whoops, whoops, whoops. No whoops. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Vaz Lab, exit out of it, confirm, then hit random. And Bridge Troll's like, I can't, can't see nothing. What do you want to see? Open your eyes, man. Open your eyes. As I oh, pull God. the giveaway, pick a winner. The factory. And Vovon VW. Vovon VW. You are going to get yourself a copy of Eternal Threads. Eternal Threads. Yay. I've got... The Factory 2. I've got On Thin Ice loaded and, and we're ready. we're clicking start in three, two, one. Start. Don't forget to do exclamation mark play on my stream, everybody. On both streams. On my stream? Yeah, I'll get to you as okay. I get this key up. Uh, 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 uh -huh. You'll get to me next month. There we go. Lower them odds just a little bit. Yes. Just a wee bit. Okay. <clears throat> As the hype train is coming to a close in 10 seconds, we did hit level two. Oh, yes. So that will be an extra giveaway at the end of the show. We'll be giving away a copy of The Big Con, where it's $14.99. I believe that's yes. the last version. Last one of those. Now I got two of those left. As we head on down the track. Oops, wrong way. Oops, I'm go I that way. Cloud bot. I want. Cloud bot sucks. Well, <clears throat> I want to know why chat bot is still not sending my fucking whispers. Well, Vol or the factory too. We're about to get packaged over here. Mom is in the lead again. Oh, did you get that whisper? You got the moo? Yeah. Did you send that inside of a... I sent that from inside the dashboard. Uh, well, the... Did you get that one? Nope. Did you get... Hold on, hold on, how do I whisper in here? Sin assistant mom battling it out as they head into the hamster ball. Damn it, that's not what I wanted. 
Then assist drops right through, taking that lead. As he gets ejected, sliding off the ice. Now Tina Please and Mom use, battling. Please use out. the whisper window. Where's the whisper window? Where are you at? Mom uh, takes the lead again. Are you in chatty? Uh, no, I'm in the Streamlabs thing. You're in Streamlabs chatbot, or are you on the dashboard and the web interface? Which one is <clears throat> I am in the Streamlabs or, desktop trying to figure out how to send uh, a... Bye-bye, Laz. Tina currently in the lead. As Mom is rimming the icy hole. Yeah, I thought you guys were off today. Now well, we were off Tuesday and Wednesday. Where is the whisper window as mom falls in one more time for the win oh you got to be in the console and then right click on somebody click on somebody's name and you get the whisper window uh you click on the name and then the little gooey pops up not i'm not getting any stinking pop up here let me try click it. click on a player's me... name in the console in streamlabs chatbot you gotta go to the in console the... no 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 i said i am in streamlabs desktop not the chatbot the chatbot's not working for me for sending whispers the desktop is the web interface <sighs> what does it say in the top top left hand corner streamlabs desktop one, two, twelve, five. Desktop. Well, I don't know about that. I have the chatbot yeah. version 1.0.2.75, which that, is the desktop one, version. That that one's that's the Streamlabs chatbot. I'm trying to send that that one also not sending. Can you send it through? Okay. Stream, well, stream last, oh, you're you're, you're bring, trying bring, to do it through it. the actual Streamlabs interface. Hey. I see what you're talking hey. about. Hey, hey, but, bring, but, bring, but. bring up my stream real quick. I'll show you what I'm trying to do. I can't. You're not. You're not getting my fucking messages. Yeah, it's, but you're you're trying to do it through the chat window on the right hand no, no. side of the screen through Streamlabs. <clears throat> I'm trying to do it any way that I can, so that yeah. way I don't have to open up the Twitch fucking page in order to send a direct message to somebody now get, get the get the desktop. chatty tells me i don't yeah. have a phone number yeah <laughs> let's get mom some scrolls some more scrolls for mom because here i'll i'll even i'll even post this in chat i know how to send a fucking whisper with a streamlabs chatbot but you're not getting any of those messages and then in side of the Streamlabs itself, it's also not sending because it's not bringing up the window that it says it's supposed to do. Yeah, see, I send all mine through the uh, the the creator dashboard on the web. It makes life a lot easier. See, that, that's just that, that that's just the normal dashboard. Yeah, which has uh, I have I have the chatbot on one computer. I have the web interface on this one, and then I've got the one in the Streamlabs desktop, which I never use because that's just a window for me to. It's my monitor. It's, that's all it is. <laughs> nor normally, it's just a, a matter of clicking on someone's name, clicking the whisper button, and then copy and pasting keys. You go, Koo. You're gonna get yourself a copy of. Kingdom Two Crowns. Kingdom Two Crowns going out to <clears throat> Jigoku. As the Maynard has resub. Thank you, Maynard. And did you ever bring up a uh, Vols Lab? Not yet. I'm still doing giveaways. Yeah. Still doing giveaways. Everybody's going to become a test tube, baby. 
And Maynard, you're going to get yourself a chance to uh, also. Give us a track number. As I reset this giveaway in just a second, as we're waiting for marbles to do its thing. There it is. Let's reset the giveaway. Open the giveaway. Vols Lab. Vols Lab. I know it's down here at the bottom. The Yaws Lab? Vaz Lab. Vaz Lab. Vaz Lab. All righty. The lab is loading. We are ready to click start. We are clicking start in three, two, one. Start. 69 seconds to get in on the action. I know I don't have to actually ask because Maynard's usually a random type guy, so. He's a random guy. And I wish Fanatical would fix their website, really. I really, really, really do, because it makes it hard to give away keys when they keep filling themselves back in as if they weren't given away. Okay. <sighs> Doing weird shit, listening to Lily purr. Da, 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 da. Well, look who comes crawling back. Um, nobody. And thank you for those 500 bits. Uh, the, the Red Dragon, it's a game key for a 300-bit donation. If you donate 500 bits, that doesn't qualify. Got to be 300. 500 gets us to... A uh, game of marbles and the giveaway randomly to everybody. But if you just want a game key, it's 300 bits. That's the only one that triggers a game key going to you personally. And if you want multiple keys, then just do 300, 300, 300, 300. 300. The Maynard, Mom, and Tina all take a nosedive off the platform. I'm going ahead and following them. Mom and Lomir and myself have all been ejected. We're down to two on my side. No. Oh. Um, As bridge trolls flaming bag of poo out in front. And this is fucking stupid. Phone verification is off. Uh, here, phone verification. Uh, Batash now out in front. Chatters without a verified phone number must have followed more than a day. How about that? Da, 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 da. Let's see if that changes my ability to whisper. Lomir ejected. Bridge oh. troll gets smacked mm -hmm. in oh. as Batash gets smacked around. That's got to be Laza's setting. What's that? Uh. You would have to check your settings to see whether or not you have a uh, require phone verification off on your creator dashboard. Go to settings, go to moderation. Yeah, no, I don't require any verification. Um, 
whenever I try to send a whisper, I get sender does not have a verified phone number. Well, then turn so off the verifications. <laughs> uh, uh, you can't say that my it's like they're both off right now. And then. Maybe that's why Laz always had more of those guys that. Nope, still not. Picking a winner. I know those. Congratulations. I know those. You're going to get a copy of Hugh. Hugh. Um. Yes. What's the next map? Random. Random. Random for the Maynard. And the Maynard also cheer, cheered 500 bucks on my side. Oh, so you got another one over there then. Yes. Maynard, what track did you want? 500 bucks for you, Lex. <laughs> yeah, just give him Lord British's. Um. QA is open. We've got the Temple of Steve ready to roll. This will be the last game. Okay. And it looks yeah, like we'll hit the butt here. of the hour. We are going to hit weird things, but we are clicking start in three, two, one, start. I've got frozen up. Frozen. <sighs> Have you Googled I can't whisper in Streamlabs to find the fix? Um, no. <laughs> um, th th earlier I was looking at the facts, but yeah. Just the facts, ma'am. Just the facts. Mm hmm. And that, that just comes up with way too much, uh, random shit. And if you really pay attention to like whenever you start up tr Streamlabs chat bot, there's this interesting message that you must reauthorize everything. Um, and I've done that multiple times. Oh, I would try reinstalling then. Um, so, uh, I don't know what's going on there. All right, we are riven the brown hole in the and, temple and, of and Steve. Laz, is, Laz so bad that he didn't get in on my side. Nope, missed it. Yeah. Okay. As I am the first one out, running ahead of the pack. Maynard and Mom following behind. I think these are all changes on uh, Twitch's side. It's where they broke things. They're trying to take lessons from uh, Elon Musk and Twitter on how to break an application. <laughs> And make it unusable. It's like, I don't, know, I don't know. I don't have those problems. I'm tired of... <laughs> you can't even get into your Twitter account. What are you talking about? Well, it's that, that's... That, that's <laughs> you know, I know I know why I, that is. Yeah. Be, because he didn't... He doesn't like the spending money on two-factor authentication on those phone numbers. Which no, no, no. See? His. You know, what, what it is, is that when they ban the main account, all the other accounts are on the same phone number. So yeah. all the other accounts, while they're still active, uh, I can't authorize on the phone number because the phone number has been banned on my main account. So 
So of no, course, it, which, it, which it, I did nothing to get banned. The phone number. Well, oh yeah, you, you got banned for that too. But yeah, uh, but, but the what? other thing <laughs> is that uh, Elon also turned off SMS verification, which didn't for, happen until March. So I yeah, yeah. So, mom so you got banned in. for some other random reason. No one knows what it was. Yeah. And they won't give me an answer. I've contacted support like three or four times. They won't give me an answer. Yeah. Well, that, that, that's because there is no support left. Well, but there wasn't a three-day or a 24-hour or a seven-day or a 90-day. They went straight to permaban. You know, yes. for, for what? I have no idea. You know, again, you know, all I ever did on my main account was retweet NBNN. So, I mean, I don't get it. You know. Yeah. So, well, if you, if you want to... Oh, see, you were bot-like behavior, and they are banning bots. Oh, well, you know, considering I did that <laughs> manually every day, but yeah, my, yeah. my bots my bots on NBNN and WRFB are working just fine, even though I can't access the accounts. They're still spamming away, so, you know, that their fucking bot strategy is not fucking working, I can tell you that much. Well, we, we, we know all these things. Yeah. yeah, well, you know. Hey, man. I don't know. Is, is, did Chris go to work for them? I don't know. <laughs> hey, but everybody can send me their scrolls. <laughs> Have you Googled why do you hate use your users? Uh, uh, I don't know, but. All right. Last giveaway on game keys for now. And then, of course, it's the butt of the hour. So make sure you're bundled up as well. Picking a winner. And Voonape, Voonape, you're going to get yourself a copy of. Oh, murder and, and by Tina, numbers. Tina's like, Chris can't be working for Twitter because he's not hardcore and he's always on vacation and you'd have to stop those things. <laughs> it's like, oh man. Low blows. Low blows. Low blow. Okay. One more random track. Oh, that's uh, right. I'm sorry. That's gonna be a giveaway on Jack's side, I forgot. And and it's yeah, yeah, yeah. And we have to come over to the Moo bot and then announce that closure and then sit there and say, hey, Lomir, you're getting another streamer bundle and I'll go ahead and reopen that so that way people can like just spam exclamation mark bundle me and then it's a good thing that I was just AFK timed out and stood up. Uh, Econ Das got to get himself a streamer bundle. Okay, there, there that trade window's up. And my next track is The Gauntlet. Thank you. You're welcome. We've got Pixels Raceway. Pixels Raceway. Okay. You ready for this? Ready to click that button. We're clicking start in three, two, one. Start. <clears throat> yeah, so... Uh... I, I loved how Twitter bought a company for like a hundred million dollars. The guy decided to, uh, uh, um, <clears throat> stay employed at Twitter and receive that money over time. And then he sends a tweet to Elon. Hey, am I fired? I haven't been able to access my account in nine days. Then then Elon starts making fun of the guy saying he doesn't do shit. <laughs> then, then the lawyers get involved and say, hey, man. And, and it's like, whoa, 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 hold on. Stop making fun of the dude. He does have a disability. And uh, if you fire him, we owe him a hundred million dollars right now. That's funny. Yeah, that's fucking hilarious. Yeah. Guy who has MS. Yes. He's been in a wheelchair for 20 years. All right. As we're uh, rolling down the track. And then Elon's like, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't. I got bad information from people. Bullshit. You just randomly made shit up. 
you got no information from anybody because we all know how tweet Elon does things. Yeah, well, when you got this entire team, when you got five okay. different companies with thousands of employees of each, you really can't keep track of who's who, you know. Well, n not only that, it, it's one where it's like, how are you managing each of those five companies? He's sitting back collecting paychecks. That's what he's doing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He'd done a whole lot more for Twitter than Elon has. The Maynard noob skyblabber battling it out. But as the old adage goes, in order to make money, you have to have money. And those that don't have money will never make money. Well, you have to spend money, not have money. Oh, yeah. Well, you have to have money to spend money. Well, yeah, yeah. having having the money and spending the money, two different things, buddy. Trust me. Hey, man. Hey, hey, hey. I'm sorry to say, but if you start off with an emerald mind in Africa, you too can become an owner of Twitter. And the Maynard in for the win, getting himself some scrolls. Oh, Tina in the lead on my side. Yes, my dislike of Elon Musk keeps on growing day by day as uh, he keeps on screwing up shit that affects <laughs> property values. Ah. <sighs> How does he affect your property values? His city's nowhere near yours, is it? Yes. <laughs> is it? Yes. <laughs> Tina that, ejected. That, so, that should make your property values go up, no? No. He's causing them to go down. Because I bought because my house is 20 minutes from Tesla's Gigafactory. He's got the boring company 15 minutes away from my house. He also has SpaceX offices. Every He was moving everything into this region right near me. And then what the fuck does he do? Stupid shit. <laughs> By buying Twitter and then showing everybody that, hey, just because you're rich doesn't mean you're smart and making a bunch of fucking idiotic decisions on everything oops on screen yeah the only person right left is the maynard will he finish and Minerd is victorious so Minerd is getting some scrolls <sighs> so yes And he's a deadbeat dad. And a white supremacist, as well as a bunch of other shit. He's never, he's just good at conning people. Um, yeah, yeah, it def, he's definitely got a, a well above average intelligence, but not a genius. Um, yeah, but he has no common sense absolutely none whatsoever and uh i don't care how smart you are on paper yeah um i remember like he got in accepted to a phd program and quit on day one <laughs> why would you quit on day one unless you were like oh shit this is work and i'm way over my head but cubertic is getting a copy of Dun, dun, dun. Payday! Because that Payday 2 is actually a really fun game. I enjoy it. Um, Payday 2 for Qbert. There Heck. you go, hopefully. Yes. And then giveaway reopen for a random Steam key. <laughs> Alright, uh, so... Off to some news. Somebody actually listened to Jack for once. What? What? <laughs> so, someone listened to Jack and bring it up. A, a, a uh, title of a weird thingy. 
wish list request title updated make conversationalist npcs pot deco has been updated um um and then the original post should be edited to make it more clear especially the thread title z and then done as per jackson assist took his words that you presented why thank you z oh z thank you. yes thank you thank you, thank you. So, so the topic reads properly what the request is which is yes. make conversationalists yes. npc that go yes absolutely <laughs> yeah but i i am happy to report that uh <clears throat> maps no no uh which Ma one is it Ma uh, maps we we have our first official entrant under uh wish lists queued for review and processing on the little Grusk oh. Island. The very very first queued for review and processing. Finally. What? You know how they little said they Grusk were gonna Island? You know how they said they were gonna take wish list requests and then they'll queue them for review and yeah, you know, and then give them a Jira number. Well we have our very first one finally. And you can see where it says queued for review and processing in the uh in the title there in the Hold on, I don't see that. I I just have the ticket number. Little Grusk Island. Yeah, Soda seven one one five six. Right above that, home forums, game forums, oh, wish list oh, requests, right. queued Discuss for review Discuss and processing. Yes. Discussion in queued for review and processing. Yes, yes, okay. very, very. I believe this is the first one. Let's go just verify that. Well, it's items missing from uh, manage orders, crafting wish. wait. All, all all these are uh what Algarian posts? Yeah. Yeah, so the very first one that we actually have is the bottom one. Yeah, well, it, it, which yeah, is the, these are all different wish lists, but which, which, which is funny when you've got JRS ninety nine sitting there saying, I know this is totally not doable, but hey, why not? Any chance of all getting something like these little items from Grusk is placeable pot deco. Uh, maybe something like a water platform made to look like a little island or a sandbar. Maybe a few different color texture options. Well, from that Sean gun, it would be floating the way that the way overland pots do. Not attached to the bottom very well. Um. Sanya going, small island in Grusk is part of the terrain, so there's no easy way to separate it. Or it's Flana for placement in a POT. However, I'll add your request for such deco to consider as possible future item. Just to set expe expectations, we don't have anyone scheduled to work on such items for the foreseeable future. Yeah. <sighs> Um, how do keeping castle lots work? They don't. Ha ha! Ha ha! Yes. Uh, thanks, guys. This. They don't need to be attached. Just floating and be able to swim onto versus ha ha having to use a ladder. Make great little place for a reef underneath for fish to swim around. Maybe we can use boats fish. to drift out to them one day. Maybe, just maybe, we can have swimming and go underwater and do other things be nice maybe just one day we'll be able to sail a boat maybe just one, maybe one day we'll be able to identify where our enemy is actually at in uh, combat the galleon says i can appreciate that the devs at least explain why not they do need to do way more of that absolutely you yeah. know you know how far that little comment by Sanyu goes as well as the fact that he did put it over into a for consideration, which is what they said they were going to do. I yes. got to give I got to give a lot of kudos for Sanyo to take take the lead on this to finally make the first one for review, put it in there, and explain that 
hey, we don't have anybody slated to be able to do this right now, but you know, yeah, you have platforms. You can use platforms and change the idea of the platforms. Just you know, get somebody to do a little art artwork. Call Scotty. Uh, you know, or you can use, you know, a little bit of tech that they use to put the land underneath the castle or keep deed like, uh, suggested there. Uh, you know, you do have that, uh, tech already built into the game, possible to do that. And, and, and the fact that they were kind of, uh, <laughs> Rich Charles says, oh my God, they were just honest about staffing and <laughs> marks his calendar. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, fuck it's like why would you it's like emailed me the fucking thing damn it i gotta go find yeah. my email real quick or my my text message so that way i can click on this link and see if i can print a label da, 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 da. label print label I don't know. Do you really think we have time for the maps topic right now, or should we save that for tomorrow? Um, no, th 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 this is a great one to get into. Uh, yeah, and we only have 15 minutes. I think it, we hey, should save hey, it for tomorrow. That's a great one to get into. Okay, so we're saving it for tomorrow. Uh, okay, uh, l l let's talk about... Um, uh, uh, mob spawners, spawners or totems, yes. Well, actually, let's go to the totems one. That one. Yeah, I, sure. I, 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 I like this one. Uh, somebody we don't hear enough from uh, the lovely Marguerite. Marguerite. I haven't heard, haven't seen her in a long time. I haven't seen her since the release yes. party. Um, but this was posted two years ago, but I think it's due for another thread. Please give us the ability to savage totems back into essence or into lower level totems. Yeah. I bit off more than I can chew. Ha ha. And now I have several crazy expensive high level totems sitting around unused. Put them on a vendor for sale. And well, that, like, that, that, I was going to comment. I was probably going to PM her and go, how much do you want for them? You know, or, yeah, or, yeah I'll, I'll give you some, uh, some, uh, what do you call it? It's, uh, essence, you know, and then trade for them. Of course, uh, Anpu wants to know why aren't you using them? And it's like I keep getting my ass kicked. And ad ad advertise your dungeon for groups or go there with friends. This is a wish list thread. I'm making a wish, not looking for snarky ellipses punctuated device, motherfucker. Stop <laughs> cut that shit out. But thanks for stating the obvious. Yeah, go get a marguerite. <laughs> And if those of you who've never met Marguerite or don't know Marguerite in game, this is somebody who you should have as a friend, and you yes. don't want, and you don't want as an enemy, as you can see. Uh, Mar yes. Marguerite, Marguerite's one tough cookie, but she's a sweetheart at the same time. Uh, the, the, the drugs and. Uh... Yeah. and da, 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 da. Yeah, well, Mar Marguerite, as you can see, doesn't put up with that shit. No. And uh, again, no. uh, yeah, Mar Marguerite is a sweetie until it's time to not be a sweetie, and then she'll she'll and tear then, tear then you a new just one. Yes. Kick your ass. <laughs> Unlike mom, who will just bite your head off for no reason. I'm just I always not, have reasons. Mom, mom will kick you in the nuts just for the fun of it. Yeah. Yeah, and, and I'm talking about you in the nuts. I'm not talking about me. Yeah, no, no, not me. Man. <laughs> She's just giving me hugs. I don't know what you're talking yeah. about. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Love you, mom. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. All right. Guys, don't give me reasons, and I don't have to beat you. That's right. But we enjoy it so much. Hey. Especially as Jack. Long as as long as your name is not a person that shoots lasers out of their eyeballs, I have no <laughs> idea who that would be. While wearing a dress? Picture. While wearing a dress. Why? Why are you poking that bear? Why would you do that? 
because we haven't talked to Flair in a while. I, I don't, uh, speak for yourself. I just spoke to Flair just last week, the week before. Hey, I uh, talked to her the other day, and I think, uh, why, why would she, you poke the bear? Uh, I, I don't think because he's even she, in the winery channel, so he doesn't know this, Mom. You know, he's uh, he's, he's a little out of touch. Yeah, I'm not in any of those channels. Hey, I, I, I got an actual full virtual tour of Flair's house uh, just about a month ago. Nice. She was she she was on the phone and uh, she flipped the video and walked around and showed off the whole whole country house and you know all that good stuff. Even even went outside and shot the shotgun, uh, you know, while while she was showing it off. Yeah, that's impressive. It was. Well, I'd show you a tour of my house, but you need to sign a waiver first. Yeah. I don't think uh, you sign a waiver and. Uh, <laughs> Not not hold you liable for the medical bills that you'll have to incur after seeing all this stuff that's in your house. Don't know something like that. Yeah, something like that. But hey, I've seen I've seen the something? inside of your house. <laughs> you haven't seen it like recently. I saw the TikTok. Okay, there's, there's enough in the uh, TikTok. Yeah. <laughs> the TikTok has about seventy percent. Yeah, again. Yeah. Was anyone online yesterday morning when LB logged in for a short while? No. Um, I, I only saw the Facebook post. Oh, I didn't even see that. Yeah, it was in the Shroud channel. But Richard was showing his kids some some stuff about the game. And then he was on and off. And I have to go look at that. <clears throat> um hold on, hold on. How many pounds did she make this thing? He popped in oh, in the North Way oh. West Black Bay Mountains where he was hunting to show his daughter the dragons in game. Uh that wouldn't uh cover the boxes. Chips. Um, but yeah. Hey kids, this is the game that I use to have lots of people invest their life savings in. And then uh I didn't know what the business model was, and I, I expected other people to do all, make all their hard business decisions for me. And I appointed the people that I that were my friends that really didn't know what they were doing. Uh, who made the announcement, Sir Galleon? Uh, are you talking about Facebook? No, oh, in game. About what? He says he is scheduled to be in game again either tomorrow or Saturday. They made an in game announcement. Uh, Sunday at 2 p.m. Central Standard Time. I just remembered. Uh, so I want to know who made the announcement. That's all. Yeah. Well, it's it's not on the daily message. Uh, hold on. I got I got to share this one. This is uh, we got to we got to show this one because this is for mom. Oh, you don't you have enough empty jars, but I don't have these empty jars. This is for mom. Yes, Lily. What? what, what <laughs> no, Lily. But I don't have these jars. Yes. Lily. There you go, Bridge Pro. You can ask him about your ring. Absolutely. Yes. Ask him about your silver ring. Oh. All yes. right. Last topic. POT mob spawners. Why don't we have them? Because we have, we have them in dungeons, so why can't we have them for POTs? Um, I would like to be able to see the ability to place POT mob spawners mentioned long ago by Chris for things like cobalt encampments, where it would spawn a defined number of cobalts, etc. We do have GM potions to do simple events, 
But what if I want a band of kobolds or undead outside my city for lore purposes? It could be limited by object slots like that of NPCs so that's not abused or create issues. I know player, some players feel that pots should be saved. I feel that should be up to the pot creator to decide what rules. Absolutely. And what happens in that pot? Players can choose to not participate if they don't like it. So there's always an option. Amen kind of like how every single fucking place on the map is a no PVP loot. It's all no loot. Conjurer Dragon's like, I like this idea. When I heard the whole purpose of the Moon Towers to prevent monsters from entering the cities ah, had been abandoned and reduced ah. Moon Towers to being pretty much useless decoration, I was disappointed. As long as the governor can decide if his pot is safe and unsafe, I am, then you would actually have to put the spawners for every mob type. Ancient Again, dragons. Why, why isn't there? Yes. Why isn't there? There should be. There should be. Yeah. The, I, I, the, I, I, yeah. Let's finish this before we get to some quick commentary. Indeed. I recall people mentioned the moon towers of past for sure. Would make some more than pretty deco. Could also allow them to show the moon tower shield on the POT like Al's head, which I believe as the intended graphic to show what had moon towers. I just personally don't like this idea at all, unless it was only within specific parts of player our player-owned town. That would not interfere with the player vendor system of players-owned towns. For example, I head off to Silverdale Market to go buy something. I stand there and wait for the list to load. Locate the best price, head off. I then suddenly have to fight creatures, of which I might die, depending on the player. Equals bad. There are no consequences for death, dude. None. If, however, there is some kind of isolated area in town where I could, I could avoid that has no player vendors at all, and I can completely avoid no, no problem with that. Remember, this is spawners created and placed by the stewards and the POT owners. So, yes, they can place it wherever <laughs> they want to. Yeah. Um... Um, ha and Conjurer's like, hasn't one of the developers mentioned a while ago that monsters in the city would be a problem as there is no mesh for them to move on so that that would not simply be possible within the real city, only outside the city within the zone? Not really. There are no cities, dude. There's walls that you can put, but there are no cities. And you probably wouldn't frequent that town, right? Because the POT owner put the spawners in there. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, Z's like, there is a mesh. We have deer, shop, etc. spawners that use Sheep. the area around Sheep. them, so it's very possible. Sheep. Cheat. <laughs> uh, and and uh, it's just a matter of putting, like, spawner. You've got this locate th this this area and then you can put like the range too possibly just another toggle long range short range medium range whatever <clears throat> when we same when we summon mobs with gm potions the issues come down to them navigating on the player properties from the town land which is not possible as each house has its own mesh i think you know what let them avoid that shit and go into anything into everything because they're invasion force. You know how many spawners they would sell if they put them in the Kodo store? You know Three. how many? Yeah, they'd sell a lot. We can put them in dungeons. That's fine. But we can't let you put them in your towns because... Why? Now, um, if I want my towns to be overrun with, you know, kobolds and dragons and leeches and lions and yeah. tigers and bears, oh my. Oh my, uh, yes. Yeah, oh my. Uh, that's my choice. And I don't want to hear this BS about players being able to game the system, okay? When I've seen somebody one-shot a fucking dragon, don't tell me the players can game the system for an, an advantage, okay? The idea is if I can build them 
into a dungeon, I should be able to build them into a town and take advantage of it. If I can find a way to funnel them so that I can just pluck them off with a bow and arrow as they come through the funnel. Yeah. It's called kidneys, folks. It's called kidneys. You yeah. Know, that allows you to figure that out. Do we have leeches? Yeah, we have leeches. It, 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 <laughs> Giant it, it, leeches. It, it's like the people like bitching about like, oh, no, my the, the pop property boundaries. Oh, no. What if I'm vending shit? It's called a fucking invasion. That invasion was set up by the POT owner. Yeah, which again, you'll, you'll allow some rando with a GM potion to spawn whatever he wants, but you won't let yeah. the POT owner populate his own village with the way he wants to do it and make money off of it, by the way. Make money off oh, yeah. of it. Yeah. And, and and not only that, it makes things more interesting. It's like, hey, take man, it easy, Bridge Show. Darby Dragons, yeah, Darby Dragons. Oh shit! And speaking of that, it's time for us to get out of here. The end of the show. That's right. But uh, yeah, yeah. You know, uh, again, this this is a topic that uh, should be looked at. I don't want to hear the uh, players can take advantage of it. Players can take advantage of every single scene out there, especially them control points. So if you have a problem with that, oh, yeah. nom, 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 nom. Thank you, Tina. Yeah, then, uh, you know, that's your problem if you have a problem with that. Yes. Hello, it, it, Mary it, Dane. Getting there, himself. There are so many uh, exploits uh, out there related to XP gain. That shit's not really useful. You have a trade Super window draft. open with Lomir? Yes, I do. Oh. That's why I can't trade with them. Super you want on draft both sides. Forever. Getting a steam key of smoke and sacrifice. Bovan VV is our game key winner. And he's going to yeah. get himself a copy of... I don't know. What is he going to get himself a copy of? Hang on one second. Oops, oh, we take a look that at that. <laughs> Oops. Born window? Oh, you, it, no, it was the dashboard so people could actually see the... Oh. Bovan VV is going to get themselves a copy of Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> on Steam. <laughs> but uh, we'll be back with more tomorrow right here on Fruck Awesome Friday. Bring your uh, soap boxes because uh, that topic that we all know and love is back once again in the uh, forums about maps. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's one of our favorite topics because, you know, when when people are still complaining about it, and we're still complaining about it. Maybe you should fucking fix it. Maybe I don't know. It's only been only been you know seven, eight, nine something years, you know. But uh, anyway, yeah. we'll be back with more tomorrow right here on NBN. Until then, I'm Laz. I'm Jack. And we are NBNN. Have a great day, everybody. We'll see you all tomorrow. Bye bye.